fiction with attitude. Oh, attitude. Or tell Weaver are responsible for any permanent damage to you, your soul, or anything. Are uh, sexually encountered any creatures from hell through tail we you're welcome. <laughs> Thank you. Don't look at my badly drawn. Don't Jay look at my hands. pussy! Damon Philia. Yep. Oh boy. Oh fuck me. Jukebox. <laughs> Jukebox. It just plays a bunch so, of. Okay. Do, do I need to like block this out because there's a lot of. I can barely tell. I don't know. I probably will. Just. I, mean, to, I guess you could. I. I don't. Just to I can't not see anything, get caught. But I like. It, <laughs> I don't know. Remember, this channel is not for kids. Please and be 18 and older to be to watch this. It's not place. a kids channel. If you have YouTube kids, don't watch this. Yes, it is intended for people 18 plus. Please be that. <laughs> Please be that. <laughs> it's funny how things turn out somehow, isn't it? <laughs> Fuck, this is gonna suck. All right, <laughs> here I am currently, not the person I used to be. Yeah, that's so. Things work. I've been through the most unlikely series of events anyone could possibly imagine. Fuck! <laughs> this is gonna be bad. He's gonna tell us about how he like met the love of his life while he like I don't know tripped on like some bubble gum on the street or some stupid. I've seen and experienced hair raising things, the sort of things that would make you go mad if you ever learned them. Mad, I say. <laughs> mad. mad. Hey. Why are you still around? You're right. Goodbye. <laughs> I just turn it off. <laughs> it looks like you're not that easily scared, eh? Oh, well then, Jesus. it looks like I can reveal the whole shocking truth to you. Oh my god. It all started... Like really long chin people. Like that one that would <laughs> Yeah, like Gauken Handsome. Yeah, that was awesome. I wish that worked. It looked awesome. <laughs> Whoa! Yeah, I like that... Uh, Shout out to PowerPoint. Yeah, I was to that PowerPoint effect. Uh, actually, I need to begin earlier on than whatever that picture was. To, like the James actually, Bond intro. Everything started while I was still in my teens. When you were the moon. Excuse Everywhere me? around me, classmates started fucking each other. <laughs> Some of them were gay too. <laughs> the kids everywhere were holding hands, giggling, teasing, and eventually <sighs> making out. But I was like, man, if everyone's doing it, why aren't you? <laughs> I hope you play as that male symbol. Look at the green male symbols on the right. They are just they are like, going doing in. it in the butt. They've got like they got the two over there. They're all ring. doing it. They're all kind of doing poses too. Yeah, they're 69ing of like the yeah. a couple down in the lower left. Or he's like just smacking that lady in the face with his dick. Yeah, I mean whatever, whatever you're into. Whatever, man. As long as everyone's but, cool. As long as everybody's <laughs> cool with it, it's all good. In the symbols for yeah, the pretenders. Why? why? Shit, why? Why am I the why only one who's not fucking? Why was there never someone to love me? I mean, it's <laughs> not like I expected much. I wasn't looking for some supermodel to come along. Oh my God. I, was, I wasn't looking for that one eternal love. I mean... You know, I'm not looking for Mr. Right. I'm looking for Mr. Right now. <laughs> Is a one night oh, stand no. too much to ask for? <laughs> Holy shit. It's... Obviously, when I did the asking, the answer was yes. So I went to my school days and remained a virgin. I went through college and remained a virgin. Oh, we're going to start out as adults? Ago. This might be crazy. They're not going to be in high school. That's, not, that's great. I was still a virgin. This is like some, yeah. This is like some teen comedy starting. Yeah, like, it's something like it has like, like a, the soliloquy. It's, it's like it's, a, it's like a gross out teen comedy from like the fucking like late nineties or yeah. two thousands. So it's just got like fart noises and like retro record scratches. Yeah, and fucking like uh, Ben Stiller for some reason. Yeah. <laughs> there I was, a twenty something virgin named named named. All right, I've like, always said something fuck every day. <laughs> so you go ahead. Oh, okay. Um, 
maybe something is less creatively bankrupt than me. But <laughs> hey, fuck, that's gonna be that's gonna be tough. I don't know what the fuck. I don't know how to be more creatively bankrupt than you. <laughs> <laughs> that sounds like a tall order. Oh shit. Uh, let's see here. Um, uh, okay. So like we're fucking we're like we're like uh we're like virgins and we're like adults and we we want to we want to fuck so bad. Um, I have to come. Who, 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 uh, um. Uh... No, no. <laughs> Distance, oh, oh no. I got one. <laughs> uh, I'll, I'll go with this. Um. Winsell. Ah, there Winston. you go. Yeah, that's good. I like that. Winsell Winston. Thank you. Gee, some people don't understand what you're asking from them until you... I was about to say lick them. <laughs> Anyways, here I was in my bedroom. I was early Monday morning and I desperately needed a cup of coffee. Man, I need a cup of coffee. What the hell? That's your anime pick character. This, that's Winsell Winston. <laughs> that's like exactly went, what he should look like. I went to see whether I had some left in the kitchen. Maybe I have some left Why in the kitchen. Why is there a laugh track sometimes? What the fuck is going yeah. on? As I was oh, running like through the shelves, I suddenly had a very weird it's weird. It's weird. It's weird. So something wasn't right. Wait a minute. Something ain't right here. It's as though, as though, as though some weird narrating voice keeps coming on my face. Oh, Oops, oh sorry. Jesus. Just be quiet, Kay. Uh-huh. This is so funny. I heard this in every fucking one of these things. Yeah, This yeah. self-referential. Oh, the narrator's right, the part, I can shit. hear the narrator. Why? Oh, my God. I was actually beyond depressed. Uh, I had accepted my life was crap, and because my entire worth is only predicated on whether a girl wants to sleep with me and I have no other dimensions to my life. Uh, yep, that sucks. Monday morning, <laughs> another week of crap ahead. Schedule for today. Get to work. Bore yourself to death. Go back home. Don't kill anybody on the way. Sounded oh, like God a plan. Sakes. I grabbed my jacket. This guy from... is a wind cell. <laughs> yeah. I was about to leave the house when suddenly something occurred to me. Wait a minute. It's the first <laughs> Wait a minute. I left some month. spare coochie in the fridge. <laughs> I can just go grab that out and just stop being a virgin. <laughs> it's the first Monday of the month. The check's coming through. <laughs> the issue is too. <laughs> <laughs> I picked up a few bucks from my savings jar and hurried out of my apartment. Instead of going straight to work, I took a slight detour this morning. A detour I always took on the first Monday of the new month. The detour was a was to the newspaper stand near the town square where the new issue of my favorite magazine had already arrived. Smut. Good old-fashioned adult entertainment. A leak slap. Political... S oh, it's The Onion. Okay. Political uh, yeah. satire monthly. Well, of course we're I'm just gonna get we're all here for the porn. Yo, right? I, I read I read the train now, and like there was a dude on the train today who was reading a fucking like hustler. Really? Just, just reading it. Huh? Just just, just on the train. Like reading. Like, yeah, he was just he was hat open on the part with just words. Just reading it, and he folded the like back so you couldn't see the naked lady. But every time he had to adjust, you could see the whole thing. And I was like, I that's wow. brave. All right. Clearly, it's not as brave as I thought because nobody gives a shit. <laughs> hey, what did you the studio audience here. I never had a girlfriend, but that doesn't mean I never had sex. Besides, you can only have sex with people you really love, right? I really love myself. <laughs> For enough sex. Look at those cars. Anyway. Those cars are really good. I like those cars. Those are like the cars the news uses for like reenactments. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so I headed back to my part of town. I worked in a small second-hand bookstore specializing in rare and historical portfolios. Did he like three model books. all of those books? That's pretty cool. They don't oh, look really? that great, but it's like cool if he did. Damn. The bookstore was called McGuffin Books, a name that had been carefully and skillfully chosen for its McGuffin subtle books. hidden meanings by this its guy owner. This guy watches fucking Channel Awesome and shit. Oh, yeah. He had some fucking, like, Stuart McGuffin. You are five minutes late, Winsel Winston. Any explanations? None you would expect, Mr. McGuffin. Thought so. There's, like... 
Why is there a studio at studio audience applause and shit? This is so right? fucking bizarre. I hope that like you Kramer's need to in this take your job reason. more seriously. What if a customer had stopped by just now? Yeah, I'm the mix. I Mr. guess he McGuffin. would have asked you for help, wouldn't he? Wouldn't a MacGuffin make more sense if it was like a movie store? Yep. Ah, oh, whatever. <laughs> That's beside the point. What if someone had appeared here with a gun trying to rob the store? Oh, in that case, I'd be glad not to be here. <laughs> Man, they really yeah, do that yeah. for every joke. Yeah, yeah they do. No, I this is I love this. This is incredible. <laughs> oh, for the love of Jesus, Mary and Joseph. <laughs> Winslow, Winslow Winston. Winston. So like the I fucking full like house when Joe plays of Winslow work. Winston. <laughs> <laughs> it's a rare condition. <laughs> this start. <laughs> This started to re- Full House really fell off after the eighth season when they added <laughs> when Winslow. Winston. 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 <laughs> he's just some dude who moved into the house who's just like fucking. He's he just always bitches and he never gets laid. That's all he does. Everywhere and you else. look, everywhere you, you look, is some Chad. <laughs> is some Chad stealing your Stacy. <laughs> 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 Did I take a guess? You have a hard time finding another guy who's willing to work in this store. Nine to five, Monday to Saturday, only with a half hour break at noon. Someone who has some sales talent, keeps himself relatively clean, doesn't eat or drink inside your shop, and knows enough Latin to organize your medieval index. And all of this for minimum wage. Whoa! <laughs> Don't worry, Mr. McGuffin. There must be millions of people out there. I get your point, Winslow Winston. I get your point. <laughs> Anyways, I'm still deducting your delay from your lunch break today. You will be back in the store precisely 12.25, not a minute earlier. Now, or welcome else? back to the Disney Channel original, Winslow Winston. <laughs> <laughs> this does like the, the mouse ears, but he like, yeah. he just draws, he just draws like boobs because he's too fucking horny. He's just like, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Also, the, f- the delay from your wage, considering how often you have already asked me for an advance, I don't think you'll get along with less money, will you? Probably <laughs> not. This is like a fucking Newgrounds game. Yeah. If there's so customers arrive, do your best. And don't piss me off. No buying books. <laughs> okay. One man, you're branded for life. Did you say something? No, Mr. McGuffin thought so. It just is written like a 90s sitcom, too. Yeah. That's, that's nuts. This is insane. I can't believe this is like... Then he went and left so me alone for the rest of the day. Along, alone with plenty of work, that is. Stack of books and interest card for each volume. Make a note of everything. Who cares? Boring job. Got it. A few hours passed. Must have been just before noon when... Yeah, a small man grew to a large size. <laughs> he was very he was ant man sized and got real big in front of me and he was all and he looks a lot like Kramer. I just got nice back from the microverse. <laughs> ah, I didn't hear you come in. Oh, did I startle you, young man? Excuse me, I didn't mean to. This is serious. I think it's a theme song. This is like old. This is it's like, like Trigun here. Yeah, it, it, this might be just ripped off Trigun music. This might just be ripped off music. Is this store still open? It sure is. We usually close from 12 to half past 12, but you're already here. Marvelous. Please allow me to introduce myself. I'm a man of wealth and taste. Uh, he handed me a business card, apparently an expensive one, made of thick, silky paper with a fine lettering on it, and then Patrick Bateman's, like, freaking out about it. <laughs> Have you seen that? <laughs> like, that American a... Psycho? Oh, yeah, yeah, when yeah. He, they're, like, all having this big jerk-off session about, about the their... Business. Yep, I, re- I remember About that. their business cards and shit. I've seen that scene. I actually haven't seen that movie start to finish, but I've seen a bunch of scenes from it. Yeah. <laughs> said mark felucil antiques and rare commodities mr felucil it's pronounced fuck my butt <laughs> uh, but the pronunciation is not important what's important is my reason for being here i quickly put the business card in my pocket uh, if you're here for selling books quite the opposite you're a young and hasty fellow i'm here to look for books one book to be specific I'm looking for popular fiddle tunes from Georgia, the 1901 edition, polished by John Boyle. 
Ouch, that sounds pretty special. Really? <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> My sources tell me that it was sold to this bookstore a few months ago. Well, I can look for it in the index. If you do me the favor, young fellow. Sure. He took out the card in Xbox and started searching. Popular dancers, festivals, fishing. Yep, I accidentally skipped a card. Popular fiddles, tunes from How does he not have a goddamn computer to look up this shit? Because this... Because he run, he's like an old school guy who like runs the old Dewey Decimal System. Ah, uh, got it. E, row 3, number 21. Yep, we have it. Perfect. Would you fetch it for me? On my way, Mr. Fuck My Butt. <laughs> Mr. <I> fuck. <laughs> Mr. McFucks My Butt. Mr. McFucks My Butt? Um, do you think you could like maybe like uh help me with my ass? That's all I do is help you with your ass. Uh, all I do is help you with your ass. There's a small book found in aging red leather. Here you are. The next can I check for missing on. pages before I pay? Of course you can. However, there's nothing. There's there's nothing about any faults on the index card, so the book's in good condition. Do you mind if I check for myself? Of course not. Mr. Fox, my butt went through the book very carefully, as though it meant a lot to him. Suddenly, he stopped, and then he pulled something from between the pages that looked like a folded letter. Ah, here it is! Oh, there's been nothing on the index card about something lying between the pages. Young fellow, this is what I've been looking for. How much for that letter? Ah, uh, the book is twelve fifty. I guess the letter would go with it. The book doesn't matter to me. How much for just the letter? Well, that letter wasn't on the index card, and it's a card for Mr. McGuffin wrote himself, so I guess that wasn't that important to him. Keep it if you want to, no one's just going to miss it. Young fellow, I'm thrilled. You're actually giving it away for free? Uh, wait a minute, is this letter valuable? Well, it has sort of sentimental value, but to me alone. I doubt any other people would care about it. I don't know, maybe I should wait until Mr. McGuffin is back in the evening. I'm only his employee, I'm not supposed to make any decisions. Winsel Winston. Winsel Winston. It's like fucking. It used to be it's like Dennis the Menace. Yeah. Winsel Winston. <laughs> why are you ja Why are you jerking off into our garden hose again, Winsel? Winsel. <laughs> Did she just say that? Mr. McGuffin probably wasn't going to the letter anyway. Oh, that's oh, great. Yes. I love that. <laughs> Would he say that to you? If you're able to tell him that son had to come here and out of sheer gratitude for your good advice, decided to, that to donate a real volume to every, to every store? Whatever. I don't know, maybe. Why don't you just ask for another one, idiot? Oh, he certainly won't say that after having seen this zip. Uh, but this flourish. Mr. He just Frank. like puts his like flat dick into a book. <laughs> and like, he's like, this is how I mark my pages. <laughs> Uh, surprise I fucked the books. Coat and then with a thump. It's one of the last remaining copies of George Conrad's horse, the Zauber Bibliothek. Believe me, Mr. McGuffin will be thrilled to get his hands on this one. You don't know, this book looks pretty valuable to me. Are you sure that, as I said, this letter has great sentimental value to me, enough to outweigh the value of this volume? Do we have a deal? At this moment, I could have said many things. I could have told Mr. Fox my butt that I really needed to double check the <laughs> deal with my time. boss. I could have politely refused such shady business. Heck, I could have insisted on him buying that damn popular fiddle tunes from Georgia was, along with the, the letter. I, I like how the laugh track for that. I, I like how it was a very tepid laugh, so it's like yeah. this one's not our favorite joke. They should have just stolen the married with children laugh track, because that shit was nuts. Yeah. They had the best fucking, like, studio audience sounds. Like, they, their studio audience was crazy. Yeah. Then I said the following. Oh, what the hell. Great. A pleasure doing business with you, young fellow. Au revoir. Er, uh, oh, yourself. <laughs> I just imagine it plays that, like, Super Mario Brothers noise and you pick a level, like, do 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 Yeah. He was gone. I was left with the old volume on the table. Oh, let's see. Catalog, catalog. After tonight, I'm going to leave him a scatalog. <laughs> the first thing I needed to do was check the library. That's how I quit the catalog. library. They told me to catalog all these books. <laughs> I left him a scatalog. <laughs> <laughs> 
It's like, oh, man, please don't. Don't shit at the library, please. Please don't. Oh, there it is. No, but really, attack over Vaz is over in Thera and Muntik is over in Hexen and Hexen Prost and Damon and Gasparin. You fuck. What a long title. Another reason to hate. Oh, jeez. I'm not touching Winsel. this. Uh, first. <laughs> Winsel! <laughs> First issue, 1821 Six volumes. And here's on my table. I'm just imagining this episode of Dennis the Menace. He's just like fucking like, he like stole a pie he's out the like, window. And he's like, Winsel! He's like, hey, this is like the Holocaust, isn't it? Winsel! <laughs> you don't joke about that! <laughs> I'm gonna tell your parents, Winsel. Oh man, I better cheese it. <laughs> it's like all laughs and like just like lighthearted, even though it's like, dude, stop, <laughs> stop, Winsel. <laughs> Gus to go. But my German was a little rusty, but this had to be a complete edition. All six volumes in one book. Eighteen nineteen, but the first part was published in eighteen twenty one. How can there be a complete edition two years before? And then it clicked. Oh crap. A fake. Damn, I should have known that no one would have traded something of real value against some old letter. Can't let Mr. McGuffin see this. He'll be furious when he sees I've accepted a fake, even if it was for free. Uh, there are fiddle tunes from Georgia. I put it back on its shelf before getting back to the counter and closing the big... Alright. We're gonna jump ahead a little bit to get to the demon philia. Yeah, when does that happen? I forgot well, the Well, that, they're kind of setting it up with like popular fiddle tunes from Georgia. Oh, okay. And, that uh, yeah, that makes and sense. And then there's all this Latin that's being spoken yeah, all the time and that's uh, yeah, I get it. I wasn't really picking up on it at all. I was like, fuck, what the hell is the purpose? At least I hope that's what they're building up for, because uh, otherwise, yeah. I would have feel like this is a big fucking waste of time. Oh, absolutely. And I was like, hey, my friend came from like 40 minutes away <laughs> to do this shit. It was alright, it was 40, 40 minutes well spent. <laughs> Any minute with you is a moment well spent, bro. Aw. Uh, but, this is fucking trash, yeah, and I'm sorry about that. Oh, this game sucks, but at uh, least that, the laugh track is really kind of doing it. <laughs> yeah, it kind of is. Kinda also, wind cell is pretty strong. 24 minutes past 12, and I was back at the store. As I had expected it. <laughs> I just got back from the Winsel giant Winston, kingdom, Luigi. I'm surprised. You're actually on time. Well, it's Mr. Like Bob Hoskins. <laughs> yeah, he does. I had to make up for this morning. Well, well, well. Anything unusual this morning? Nothing. No sales, no offers, just someone looking for a book. Oh, looking for a book. Yeah, he didn't buy anything. He had to show off one volume, though. I guess it wasn't what he wanted. Hmm. Well, I see that you've been able to get a, cat, a lot of cat or a rat. Fuck. Um, so he's like, oh, everything finished by five. Okay, well, bye. So, oh, lunch break. Ha, 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 ha. And I can break my brain on the categorizing register. Bay pass. I'm Winsel. Welcome home, honey. Hmm, anything unusual? Not in the least. Hmm, you seem very uncheerful. I'm about the day. It must be a big smile on your face. Ha, ha, ha. And then, Mr. McGuffin, let's go. You never disappoint me. What was that? Uh, so let's go do something else. <laughs> Why do I have no, no friends? Oh. oh, we'll be back to Winsell Winston <laughs> after these messages. <laughs> Winsell Winston, we'll be back. The book was still sitting on my bed where I put it. German volume, and then I let's do it. Let's summon the Satan. I do the magic summoning circle, and I summon. I it just summons that guy that showed up. Gantionis, it's Psalm Luciferi. That sounds like a good one. Yeah, it sounds I like you're like summoning Satan. <laughs> All Psalms for Lucifer. A whole chapter on devil worship. That fuck might have been fake, but also something else. And everything went white. The air suddenly... So I I did the spell. Now uh, it's the, like rotten eggs. 
someone farted and my ears were ringing as though someone had farted. They're playing like And then they cranked pipes. up the air pressure. Yeah. Like why are they, so, so like, your ears are ringing with the sound of bagpipes. It's like the stinky Scotsman shows up. <laughs> you summoned me the Scotsman! <laughs> See? <laughs> you couldn't hear, I could only smell sulfur. That was, You got flashbang. You got swatted, dude. Yeah! yeah. <laughs> <laughs> There's a SWAT guy just fucking... <laughs> Down on the ground now! Yeah, we have an illegal book in here! <laughs> we need to burn this book! <laughs> in accordance with the U.S. government law! You can't have this information in the U.S. on U.S. soil! Get the fuck out! And it's back to normal. Hi there. Almost. Ah. Oh. Why was there Hell laughing? Yeah. Oh. Uh, I mean... What is, what is, why? I can't, I can't why, see anything. Hey, why was summer. there, no, why is, the, why is there a laugh track for this? Come I don't, it, what? What, no summoning circle. It's no just, protective charm. Fucking just summon Jermaine from Pony, Pony the Squirrel. <laughs> yeah. Like, what the fuck? I should quit the brave shit? guy. No. I'm definitely not brave. Not in the least. Oh? Damn it, who are you? My name's Simone. Simone! Take <laughs> yeah, it! This big yeah, old man's it. face on the end of a Moan. big long battleship. ship. Oh, oh man, moans. this is like a sexy demon sitcom. This is this, very this weird. Is, this is a pilot pitch. This is very weird. I don't really know how to feel about any of this. Yeesh. And who might you be, Summoner? Uh, or my name's Winsel Winston. <laughs> Winsel Winston, Winston summoned Winston. a demon. Winsel Winston Excuse and me. Simone. <laughs> and, and it's gonna go get like really weird at season like it like gets a lot of seasons and then Yeah, like, like the first season's like just the like they try to run that joke into the ground just like she just like keeps yeah. trying to like fuck him all the time and he's like really not into it or something. Like that or, that's that's what or that's he's like have to super be. horny but super scared. Yeah, or something like that. Yeah. And and then like and then like like season two is like her being like oh, I don't feel wanted. And then season three is like just like they take go way, way off the rails and it's like just, they filmed the whole thing in hell. Yeah, <laughs> like the whole thing is takes place in hell. There's like not even a single like <laughs> earth interaction the whole time. Then season four comes back and it's the same as season one. I summoned you. Yeah, I'm straight from the Melbourne. Melbourne, I think. Melbourne. Yeah. Melbourne. Yeah, Melbourne. I guess that's how it's... I think it's Malbosia. I think that's right. Yeah. I I don't know how to pronounce the bad guy from Spawn. <laughs> yeah, 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 I think it's Malbosia. Yeah, I think that's what it's supposed I'm to be. I'm a succubus, a demon spawn born to seduce men. Why would you well, tell someone. people that? Wouldn't you just, like, keep that secret so, like, you get the Who stuff you want? Who commanded me to seduce? Whoa, hold your horses, don't you? Won't you? What are you... If you are what you say, you aren't supposed to be, like, sexy. You... If you're a summer... Aren't you supposed to be like intelligent? Ooh! Oh wait, I'm not a summoner. This was some accident. Accident? Yes, you see, I got this book over there, and I couldn't understand what the words from there meant, so I read them out loud. And you read them aloud? Er, yes. Without understanding what they meant? Yes. And without anyone to read them out to? Er, damn, you're dumb. Oh great, Sassy this Simone. is just great. I'm here with a demon straight from hell in my bedroom and all she does is insult me. I'm so fucking hard! That is, <laughs> how could it be worse? I have a demon who's insulting me. <laughs> oh no, this demon is here and she's it's insulting It's being me. kinda mean to me. Uh oh. Go lost. Go to hell. Literally. Oh, that was oh, like a weak laugh. Sass! This is a weaker laugh on that one. I love like, it. There's a bigger laugh when she showed up. What the fuck? Or what? Like, what did they think? What did the audience think she was gonna summon? Fucking like Christopher Reeves? Like, what is this? Like, yeah, what is yeah. shit? like, I don't get what the fuck they want from. <laughs> As I said, this is summoning you as an accident. If you all you can do is mock me for it, then you can go back to where it came from. Er, I'm afraid that won't be possible, Winsel Winston. Huh? You can't just go back to hell. You need to send me back. Er, but I said you could go. It's not that simple. You summon me with an incantation to seduce a man. If you want to return to hell, there are two ways. Is that a song or a band? What? It's a man. <laughs> <laughs> yeah.
It's, it's a man. It's a man. <laughs> it's a man. Walk out, walk out. I go hard in the pot. He just go. He just goes, and they like, they beat like everything but the things they should be. Yeah. <laughs> the first one to be to unsummon me again. How do I do that? Hey, you're the summoner. You should know. What an incantation is it? So yeah, we're, we're gonna skip ahead a bit. So much laughing happening. Yeah, all in unthinkable ways. Until a semen runs dry and he is an empty husk of a man. Interesting. Yeah, well, I never run out. Seduce? <laughs> <laughs> uh, so I could be like, don't seduce anybody, or I could play date night on basement quality February 1st through the 29th. Yeah, and, and or, yeah, Of course he's gonna seduce me. This is I date mean, night, could, February or, or 1st through the 29th. Or you get some silly, like, kid pranks on fucking Mr. McGuffin. Yeah. Yeah, we're, I know we're, we're gonna do that. This. Yeah, we're gonna do that, but I'm saying, like, hey, you? the first option is just funny. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> now what? As someone a succubus. Hey, like, I don't know. Sex demon won't sleep with Prank me. Prank phone call my boss. Winsel, Winsel. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, whoa, no, a succubus just showed up and it's ready to have sex Quite with unusual. Me? Yo, go prank phone unusual? call my boss. Sure, you're not that attractive. Oh! Ah! <laughs> you're lacking TNA, but you're pretty short. What the fuck? I guess I'm desperate enough to overlook this. What, what kind of overlook piece this. of shit? Slap. Yeah, Youch. What the fuck? You're lucky that I'll sleep with anyone you order. You're lucky to, I'm even a slut. if it's you. You're lucky I'm a slut. <laughs> <laughs> Man, the porno verse is an amazing place. Yeah, man. The por por I'm good. not gonna leave unless you suck my dick. Ah, you're lucky I'm a slut. Yeah, just, <laughs> just like, like what the hell, right? Like, it's such a fucking like. No, I'm calling the cops. Situation. It's like, ah, oh, whatever. <laughs> so I was like, oh, all right. Oh, we're in a porno verse. Okay. Yeah, yeah I, I forgot. I forgot. We're in the porno verse. I wore my best porno verse stringer. <laughs> were you taking it? Were you taking it? <laughs> A universe where you can take a bathtub in the middle of the bathroom. In the middle of the bathroom. Yep. So single bathtub. And then someone shows up to be your lifeguard to save you from that, like, two feet of water you're sitting in. <laughs> this was unusual because it's never happened before. Neither me nor any, any, for any other succubus. See, that's strange because someone besides me must have had the same idea in the last few centuries. Woof. Isn't that strange when you consider the consequences? Consequences? What are the consequences? Uh, you get your semen stolen. Like he cares. Well, like you think he cares? To do some man, that man doesn't know what's happening to him. He's a victim to us. Yeah. But if someone summons us willingly, gives us his semen, that's consorting with the forces of evil. Do you think that Wincel Winston gives a fuck about yeah. consorting with the forces They're all of the evil? Incubi, our male counterpoints, use that semen to create more hell spawn. Good. Well, good. Use my Consorted. fucking cum. Make some demons. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It's some fucking Winsell Winston. Do you think I give a shit? Sorting with the forces of evil means you go to hell right after the act. Uh oh. Your act order from the big boss himself, Smowitz, or Buns. You still want me to seduce you? Uh, yeah, of course. Go oh, what hell. the hell? Do me. Wow, you're serious. Abs no, I'm pretty whimsical, actually. <laughs> pretty um, whimsical. You do. <laughs> Life so far has been a series of disappointments. <laughs> what the fuck? I haven't accomplished a single thing, and I'd rather go to hell before I die. I work at a job for me. <laughs> hey, this is no Captain Lou Albano, and if you do, if you do drugs, you go to hell before you die. <laughs> Never got played even once. <laughs> now, can I at least get that? Well, if you say so, sure I can arrange that, Romeo. As if we're as if already in your bedroom, I'll do my very best. Yeah! As promised, she did me. Oh, it wasn't quite as bad as I thought it would be. Oh, actually, it was really fun. Very exhausting, yes, but very stimulating, very hot, and everything. Not that I had much to compare it to. As soon as it was over, I went to hell. So this is right. the I'm fucking not... field! Oh no, that's in 3D. <laughs> okay, so he made that field and he's put like a red. Okay, alright. Second circle, where those who succumb to lust happen to dwell. Well, dwelling isn't quite the right expression. A violent storm blows me around. I love, I love how that that's like what that was supposed to all culminate to. It's like, yeah, she did me. It was okay. <laughs> yeah, they don't, and they don't show you anything. He's like, yeah, she did me. It was cool, whatever. But yeah, I'm going to hell now, so I'm on hell. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> in season four. 
It wasn't worth it. I don't know yet. So far, it is much worse than my usual everyday routine, and at least I have company. Actually, on my first day down here, one of the demons approached me, quoting the words of from one of the greatest poets of all time, Sting. He said, relax, have a cigar, make yourself at home. He is full of high court judges, failed saints. We've got cardinals, archbishops, barristers, certified accountants, music critics. <laughs> They're all here. You're not alone. <laughs> <laughs> You're never alone. <laughs> Not here. Mwah. Mwah ha ha. Ha ha Okay, break's over. I think that really changed my life. Yeah. Going down the bad end. So just having sex with the like Yeah, he just right away. He just thing. tells you to go to hell if you fuck her, and he did, and then it's, and then you go to hell. Alright, well, that was a thing. For a game that has this as its fucking, like, th like uh, opening image, it's weird that, like, you do the sex and there's no sex. Yeah. That's weird. But, whatever. Whatever yeah. they want. Well, fuck you. <laughs> 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 fuck you.